Hello. I killed a bit of them while you were not here. Because not killing them would be bad, right? So I killed them. And the rest are being killed with an actual group of people that I never got. I would have preferred if they stayed and fought over there. Because mostly fighting alone was not fun. The Golden Saints in Silarn have been utterly destroyed mostly by me. I should speak to Ulfri about lighting the flame of Agnon and uh, now that her forces control both of the orders. Dark Seducer! Dark Seducer! Dark Seducer! Where's Ulfri? Ah, uh, hello! The victory is ours. I have already instructed my subordinates to kindle the Altar of Rapture. It is my honor to sacrifice myself on the altar of despair. Oh, why Lord didn't you sacrifice Sheogorath's your enemy? Command. Sacrifice yourself? What do you mean? The altars which feed the flame of Agnon can be kindled only by the willing death of an immortal. I have hoped for this moment since I took command of the Mazkin at Cylarn. I return my soul to the embrace of Oblivion's dark waters. I guess you really Farewell. wanted to die. Okay. Have fun there. Why are you healing? You're going to die anyway. I wanna see. I wanna see, I wanna see, I wanna see. Aww, it wasn't the oh! Oh, now it's impressive. Green flames everywhere! Green flames everywhere! Elfrey sacrificed herself at the altar of despair in order to light the flame of Agnum. I can now retrieve the flame from the courtyard and bring it back to New Shea of the Shogoro has commanded. Yay! Your name will be hailed whenever we toast this day's victory in our halls at Pinnacle Rock. Okay. You know us as Dark Seducers. A name given us by our enemies. But we are the Mazkin in our own tongue, Sheogorath's only truly loyal servants. Our fortress and sanctuary here in the Shivering Isles. Okay. For Sheogorath's glory. Mm, can't take their armor, and I liked it very much. Ha! The flame does nothing to me. Though standing it is kind of fun. What is it? Nothing is it. Walk with our lord. It is nothing exactly. I'm going to go that way now. Because that way is the way I should go. I don't have a torch, but does that actually matter? I suppose not. I mean, can I like light stuff up without a torch? Like... Then saying, shield, bleh, not interested. Shields are not interesting nor fun. Lots of other flamey things. It's so nice and comfy in here among the, all of the dead bodies. You just never want to leave. Insert sarcasm here. Uh... There's also people that died. Oh well. Their problem, not mine. Need fire now. Fire light stuff, fire good. And then me light stuff with the fire that I got in by lighting stuff, I think. Sheogorath's blessings upon you. Yay, flame added. Stepped into the flame of Agnon and I'm now ablaze with the holy fire. Should we turn to new share the light, the great torch, and the sac saculum of Ark and Soul? Your name will be Hay. Mm, I want the armor Sheogorath's from here. I forgot glory. how you got get what it. Is it Emma? For Sheogorath's glory. Oh well. No armor for me, I suppose. That looks kinda awesome. Should I worry that I'm on fire? No, I should not. 
That looks really cool. I suppose it's in bliss, right? Somewhere there. Let's light the fires! Let's light all the fires! Remember getting the armor once? I don't remember how I did it. Like one of the Golden Saints thing, the armor. Speak man. quickly, mortal. I don't want to speak with you at all. Have you caught my act yet? I'm Fatal the Juggler. I'm sure you've heard of me. Oh, who am I kidding? More likely you came to scoff at the worst juggler in the world. Aww. Goodbye. Poor person. You look nice, though. See you later. Where is the friggin' thing? Found it! Yay! I killed all of the golden soldiers, so now it's time to light the minor shrine. You've brought it! The holy flame of Agnon, the fire of inspiration and rapture! If you light the great torch on the mania side of the Sasellum, you will be a hero to the people of Bliss, I assure you. I light the great torch. I for you. knew I saw the glint of true mania in your eyes, my child. Go now and let the holy flame inspire the people of Bliss to new heights of madness. I will. Where is it? Where is the torch? Here it is. Yay! I should report to Shiagorath that I have left the Great Torch. Okay. Yeah, finally can move. That's great. The Great Torch shines with the pure light of mania. You chose well. In your opinion. Yay. In accordance with the ancient tradition. Receive now the raiment of Arden Su in honor of your mighty deed in service to mania. What kind of raiment is that? The humble pack. Uh, I just want to know. I got some sort of clothing and I want to see what it is. Ooh! God damn it, that's pretty. I'm so walking around like this for now. Not bad. Not bad light. indeed. Hello, Shiogoras. Aren't you off to a good start? That's important. For me. Really, your work is going to save me a lot of time. That's fun. Save you time? The Grey March is upon us, and the ordering begins. Armies of order, sweep my realm! Death! Destruction! Then I have to pick up the pieces. And it's fun. And there are always lots of pieces. Then not fun. I don't like it. Having to rebuild my realm every era. Sometimes I forget where things go, like New Sheath. I can never remember where it belongs. You'll change that. Break the cycle. You'll stop Jigalag, and I'll have my realm to come back to. I've never actually tried that before. I can stop the Green March? Why not? Something has to work. Once, I dug a pit and filled it with clouds. Or was it clowns? It doesn't matter. It didn't slow him down. To be honest, it wasn't the best idea. And it really began to smell. <gasps> Must have been clowns. Clouds don't smell bad. They taste of butter. And tears. But this is all new. A fresh idea. Something I hadn't thought of. Until I did. It's sure to work. Even though it might not. <laughs> what now? Now? You'll need the respect of my citizens. They'll need a leader. Someone to look up to when I'm gone. They're the backbone of any great land. Except where the backbone is an actual backbone. Ever been to Malakath's realm? Oh, nasty stuff. But back to the business at hand. You'll need to control one of the carts of madness. Replace a current duke. Or duchess. Whichever. 
That will command respect. The people will rally around you. You'll have their love, their admiration, their complaints, whatever, as long as it keeps them on our side. No. <laughs> no, no, no. Absolutely not. Well, yes, absolutely. Bit of a shame for them. But sometimes you need to break a few eggs or skulls. There are rules, though, even in the aisles. Rituals and rules. You need to follow them. Okay, okay. Speak to Artis Endervenen, the high priest at the Sasellum Arden Sul. They can explain what needs to be done. I will. Having my understanding right got here. And Haskell to call on for help. Faithful, like a good hound, that one. And he looks better in a suit. Jigalag? This time, I'll beat him. I can't stand losing, and I don't mind cheating. That rhymed. It's already started, but you might be able to stop it. We're making you into a leader that people can trust. Someone to look up to. Someone to blame. Yay. Once I'm gone, things usually get bad quickly. Lots of defections, lots of carnage, but with you at the helm, things will be different. Whatever. Uh, come visit again. What? What else can I help you with on this glorious day? Uh, how to kill a duke. Yes, how we would all aspire to be as great a leader as the first. Our savior, Arden Sul, the greatest duke of the ages. We celebrate him with the ritual of accession, the path to maniac bliss. Ritual of accession? An important part of our history, my friend. I would be glad to tell the tale if you have a moment. Okay. I'll have lots of stuff. Time is one of them. Arden Sul was perhaps the greatest duke to walk our land. Many years ago, he decided to hold a night of absolute indulgence, resplendent with dance, wine, and sex. Yay. To celebrate his fondness for his brethren. The green moat flowed like water in a stream as the revelers voraciously succumbed to its rapturous ways. I like rapture. This hardly sounds lethal. Ah, but it was. As the bacchanal reached a crescendo, the people began to clutch their chests as their very hearts exploded. The green moat had taken its toll. The ground stained a deep crimson as the sanguine liquid flowed from their lifeless bodies. To represent that night, when the ruler of mania is to be replaced, he partakes of the green moat and allows his lifeblood to flow upon the altar. Tell me what to do. Certainly. When the ruler of mania has decided it is time, he will choose a successor from his court. The successor is invited to a huge celebration, a night of hedonistic revelry, wine, song, and of course, green moat. During this, the exiting regent imbibes three doses of the potent drug. This causes his heart to burst, and his lifeblood flows from his body. The successor then gathers the drug-tainted blood and brings it to the altar of Arden Sul in the Sasellum. Once this is done, I will proclaim the successor a duke or duchess. Then, Sheagorath gives his blessing, and the cycle is completed. I've spoken to Dervin, the High Priest of Mania. The ritual of accession for Mania requires the current ruler to commit suicide by taking three doses of green moat, which is lethal. Then his drug-tainted blood must be brought to the altar of Arden Sul at the Sucellum. Should now speak to Arctus to look to Dementia's ritual. Okay. I'm disappointed in your choice. You'll find Mania to be a fickle friend. I like Mania, it's colorful. 
Seldom is the subject ever br Wait a moment. Did you want to hear the history of the ritual? Why not? As it happened so many years ago, you sound my like a lord orc. Arden Sul suspected a traitor in his midst. Not wishing to find himself on the wrong end of a blade, he gathered his flock here in the Sacellum. By poisoning the sacramental wine, Arden Sul was able to suppress any such conspiracy in one fell swoop. <laughs> 